sub in duos today and ended up turning out to be in um, two kills, one kill apiece. We legitimately, our only two kills came game. So, legitimately, that's what it was. So, that's where our two wins came in. And if you notice, I changed my name again. I noticed John Wick um, 1867 kind of was not really catching y'all's eyes. Only because it wasn't really relevant, it wasn't relevant or something along that line to my YouTube channel. So I figured this would sound better because this this is my YouTube channel name. I finally was able to put Tiger Twenty Four, but I put YT at the end of it. So you guys are more welcome to check me out more. So if you see me hopping your game, you can be like, "Oh, Tiger Twenty Four is in my lobby. Let me go check out his YouTube channel, see if he's live or something along that line." But this is more relevant and more simpler. It makes it more easier for you guys to understand me, why I did this. So you guys don't feel about too much, and I don't lose subscribers. Um, you, I know technically you're supposed to make a video talking about that, but I've been kind of busy with other stuff going on. Plus, my birthday was this past weekend. Plus, we're on Labor Day. Uh, today is Labor Day. Um, very happy about that to have a Labor Day. Or to be on Labor Day, but anyway. So let's get right into this, guys. Um, like I said, this one's kind of more of your, kind of your slow pace type game. Um, we only got into one fight. Uh, like I said, because we ended up landing it lucky. We were we had the circle to us. Um, I think the circle ended up finishing outside by um fatal fatal feels, I think. But uh, we'll get right into that. So let me switch over to. My boy, Alex Blake. Let me see if I can try to find him. There he is. He actually hasn't even landed yet, but this is my boy here. I know it's not in the right angle. You can see him, but that is him. Um, let's kind of... Yeah, he kind of went... Yeah, he went inside. I went outside, and we kind of just played the smart. Um, let's switch back over to me. Um, so I'm going to kind of fast forward here. I know, I, I know I've done that a lot, uh, but I'm going to kind of fast forward here so you guys can kind of get a good idea. Like I said, we don't get on our first fight until legitimately right at the end of the game where we pull off the victory, and I'm the one that actually gets the final kill this time, so I'm actually kind of happy about that. So, just going to let you guys know, uh, there's supposed to be a chest right here, and I don't know why my guy f stops right here for some reason. I don't know why he's doing that, so I'm going to try to fast forward here to try to get it caught up, because for some reason, it should be showing him picking up a chest. I don't know why it was doing that. Um... But that's kind of basically it at this point. So like I said, let me kind of fast forward a little bit halfway through this and kind of show you what we kind of did. So let's get right to it. I mean, it was okay. I mean, I would say this is kind of more of like us playing it safe than anything else because we kind of... My loot wasn't that great until the very end when I, I mean, I, I mean, I got a scar out of a, I think out of a chest because I, um, I want to say we pushed out of Lucky, yeah, we pushed out of Lucky and we ended up moving up to, um, gas station over here close to Paradise, yeah, that's where we ended up moving up to, um, that's kind of, that's kind of it. I mean, there wasn't really that much we basically did besides just kind of get material and kind of hanged out. Now, I just want to let you know about this one. This was our fourth game in, and we ended up winning it, by the way. I just want to make that loud and clear to you. This was our fourth game in, and we were having problems with our first four games because we were, we, were we were playing way too... I want to say way too aggressive is setting a passive like we're doing here. And so I, I think we, I think we did okay. It wasn't like I wouldn't say it was that bad of a game. It was more of like we need to start playing more of these. I know it's kind of more of a low score game, but hey, we're coming out with the dubs. I'm I'm happy as hell about it. We're coming out with the dubs. I've got 30 wins already by myself on this account. I mean Tell you the truth, if you would have asked me a couple weeks ago, what have I gotten 30 wins on this count? I'd probably told you no, but you know what? Hey, I'm doing my best. But let's get back to fast forward in this just a little bit here, because like I said, we kind, like 
like I said, we just went for looting and material and kind of stuff like that to see what we got. Like I said, my loadout wasn't that great. It could have been better, like I said. I mean, I had a drum gun, a green tack, stuff like that, because I was talking with him. Yeah, let's see. I think I had a green tack, a drum gun, some bandages. Uh, I think I picked up some grenades, but I could be wrong. I don't remember. Um, and I don't think I think I think he I think he had a better loadout than I did, but that was only because I think because he ended up looting the whole place and I only looted the outskirts of it. So that was probably the reason why. Now I told him, and I'm gonna sort this down real quick and explain this to you. I kind of told him here to hop in this rift over here by this truck to kind of be a scout out, to go look and see what was going on, see where he saw people at and stuff like that. And and I was like, okay, well, then I started thinking about going up on this hill here. And then whenever I noticed he was going to go all the way over here to the secret, by the way, secret spot over here, if you can see where it's got great loot at most of the time, I thought about going up here and then he was like, you know, I'm going to go over here. And then I started running, and I was like, are you sure you don't want to hit the gas station? He is like, and he was like, no, gas station looks like it's been looted. Let's go ahead and head over here. And then when I get past it, I was like, oh, wait a second, there's a chest there. You want me to hit this chest real quick, you can come back. He was like, yeah, hit the chest, I'll, I'll be, and then we go right back. Next thing you know, I'm in, I'll come over here, there's a trap, I need to place a trap right quick, because I was almost done with the challenges for it. So... It was kind of something along, uh, just something along the lines like that. All right, my bad. He landed on the thing. He was checking for people. And I said, hey, there's a chest tool over here. Do you want me to come get it so you can loot up and be fine? He's like, yeah, go get it. I'll, I'll come over there and I'll, I'll meet up with you. So we ended up pushing back this way to the gas station to get this. All right. I know it's, I know it's kind of getting boring of me talking so much. Dude, let's kind of get right to the fight of the day because it's kind of getting a little boring. See, and this is where I pulled the scar out. I asked him if he wanted it. He said, nah, he was good. And then, so like that. I mean, like I said, we kind of we played it. I want to say we kind of camped. Like, we camped really, really hard. Um, it, I mean, it, it wasn't that bad. I would say it was kind of a little bit better. And then he ended up dropping me a trap. I had two traps. I two traps up here to kind of play it safe. And... This was kind of it. I mean, like I said, we only came out with a total of two kills. One kill apiece for both of us. Final, so, I mean. <laughs> there wasn't that really lot to do here besides just kind of figure out what we should do going into the next circle. Now, he had a rift to go on him. I will say that. He had a rift to go on him. So, we were trying to figure out what we should do. How should we play this out? How should we wait this out or something on that line and kind of make it look good or something? Um, let's see. Um, sorry about that. At this point in time, we kind of were just like, I think I pulled up the map and I said, if there was anybody over here, let's play it smart and let's see what happens. But at the same time, crouch zoomed in right there because like if you're crouching you use a rift to go and makes your camera kind of zoom in that's kind of basically it um and we thought and i will say this let me fast forward just a little bit here because yeah, let me fast forward just a little bit more here so I can explain the reason why I said there was uh, we thought it was a team and we go finding out it was two solo guys. So I I, st I started going down and then I'm gonna kind of let it play from here because I was going down to the ground and then we had a rocket coming our way and I was like oh shit there's a rocket. Bars, mine gets destroyed. I'm like, oh shit, there's a rock. And this was kind of the guy that was kind of pushing us. I want to say. So we kind of, we, and I didn't know he was putting that bouncer up. So like, okay, we got a bouncer away. So, but like I said, right here was kind of more. I want to say, kind of more of just playing it smart, playing it to the circle, basically playing your best at it. 
But that's kind of, like I said, that's kind of basically it. I mean, <laughs> there ain't really much to talk about. <laughs> there ain't really much to talk about besides just kind of getting kind of built here, get covered up in a good spot, get ready for a fight. So I'm gonna let it, I'm gonna let it play from here to the end because you'll understand the reason why I'm saying. Like, um, they, we played it smart. I wouldn't say we played it bad. It was more of like, what should we do here? Because here's the funny part. This dude was just basically standing still the whole time while he was shooting us. And I was like, wait a second, this dude's standing still. Like, I say, yes, I do. So he'll come up to me here in just a moment, and I'll drop him. Now remember, all I had was a drum gun on me after I dropped this scar. Well, a drum gun and something else, I don't remember. But, sorry, I didn't mean to take that away. So, at this point, it was kind of, um, yes, yeah, so I dropped the scar here for him. He picks up the scar. Oh, yeah, I had grenades on me. And then after he shot, Alex basically just, Alex right here, just like, the boy on Killed him. I threw two grenades. Because. We pushed for. No, we pushed for this dude's loot. And I was like, yo, Alex, there's one dude left. So. Push for this dude's loot. We end up. I, I end up throwing a grenade because I see the guy. He was going to try to shoot at me. Alex gets a grenade launcher. Starts lighting this dude up. Now, right here is interesting. Notice there's a gold scar on the ground, right? I went and picked up a gold scar. And legitimately, to tell you the truth, I lit this dude up with the scar and the drum. Lit this dude up. Now was playing. Now was just kind of playing more of like the build. I was kind of playing the people. I thought I was going to die here. Had to reload my scar and. And legitimately, Al if I would have gone down, Alex would have killed him instantly with no problem about it. But, alright guys, that's basically a victory royale right there. That's another win. So, here we go. Now, I will say this. There, um... And after that win, we got another win the same day. So we got two wins in the same day. The second one, I've got an interesting story behind. You need to hear. We end up pulling five kills. He pulled three. I pulled two. And the, and the next, not in this one. This one, we only pulled two. The next one, I will talk about here in just a little bit. We end up pulling five kills. And there's a very, very interesting story behind it. And I will explain it to you. But anyway, I hope you guys have a wonderful afternoon. My name is Target24. This video and the next video will be up on YouTube later today. And also, I'm going to kind of give you a little hint. I'm hosting a tournament this weekend. It is a 2v2 Fortnite tournament. I will have more detail for that on probably Tuesday or Wednesday to give you more details on that. So, it will probably be Friday night or Saturday night. One of those two nights, I'll be hosting it. So, if you want to have an opportunity, it's just for Brian and Rice for right now, but uh, but maybe the next tournament after that might be a $20 gift card, but it just depends. But anyway, hope you guys have a wonderful afternoon. My name is Target24, and I will catch you guys in the afterlife. Peace out, guys.